This is no one from nowhere, and you are, and I am a spirit of God. Today I want to talk to you about Anu Seal, Lord of Hosts. First a joke, what dance do all aliens know? The moonwalk. <laughs> the Lord of Hosts means planets in our solar system including the earth, the sun, moon, stars, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Orion, Big and Little Dipper, and the Pleiades, etc. in our firmament. Psalm 24.10 Who is the King of Glory? The Lord Anu of Hosts. He is the King of Glory. The seven heavens and the seven earths in Sumerian. An, I N, B, Key, I M, B. The true God and false God. Thus says the Lord, Earth's King and Redeemer, the Lord of Hosts. I am the first and I am the last. There is no God but me. Who is like me? Let him stand up and speak. Make it evident and confront me with it. Who of old announced future events? Let them foretell to us the things to come. Fear not, be not troubled. Did I not announce and foretell it long ago? You are my witness. Is there a God or any rock besides me? Idol makers all amount to nothing, and their precious works are of no avail. As they themselves give witness, to their shame they neither see nor know anything, and they are more deaf than men are. Indeed, all the associates of anyone who forms a god or cast an idol to no purpose will be put to shame. They will assemble and stand forth to be reduced to fear and shame. For thus says the Lord Anu, the creator of the heavens, who is God, the designer and maker of of the earth who established it, not creating it to be a waste, but designing it to be lived in. I am the Lord, and there is no other. I have not spoken from hiding nor from some dark place of the earth, and I have not said to the descendants of Jacob, look for me in an empty waste. I, the Lord, promise justice. I foretell what is right. Turn to me and be safe, all you ends of the earth, for I am God, and there is no other. Today I leave you with Psalm 19, God's glory in the heavens and in the law. The heavens declare the glory of God Anu, and the firmament proclaims his handiwork. Day pours out the word to day, and night to night imparts knowledge. Not a word nor a discourse, whose voice is not heard. Through all the earth their voice resounds, and to the ends of the world their message. He has pitched a tent there for the sun, which comes forth like the groom from his bridal chamber, and like a giant joyfully runs its course. At one end of the heavens it comes forth, and its course is to their other end. Nothing escapes its heat. The law of the Lord is perfect, refreshing the soul. The decree of the Lord, Anu, is trustworthy, giving wisdom to the simple. The precepts of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The command of the Lord is clear, enlightening the eye. The fear of the Lord is pure, 
enduring forever. The ordinances of the Lord are true, all of them just. They are more precious than gold than a heap of purest gold, sweeter also than syrup or honey from the comb. Remember, I am Anuel, and God is with us. You are, and I am, a spirit of God. Peace and love be with you.